Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to answer one of the Java interview questions. That is, what is a predefined class in Java using which we can receive input from user? Let me answer this question with practical demonstration. To get started, the straightforward answer for this question is scanner. Scanner is a predefined class in Java. Using this scanner class, we can receive the input from the user. Okay, the answer is pretty much clear now. Now let me practically demonstrate how to use this scanner class to receive the input from the user. For that, I'll switch to this Eclipse IDE. Here, I'm going to create a new class. I'm just going to name this class as scanner demo, okay? Using this scanner class, as I mentioned here, which is nothing but the answer for this question, using this predefined scanner class in Java, we can receive the input from the user. But how? I'm going to show you here. So I'm just going to auto-generate the main method. So inside this main method, okay, I'm going to create an object for the scanner class. Scanner, scanner is equal to new scanner. Like this, we need to create an object for the scanner class and import this scanner class from java.util package. And here inside the constructor, we have to write system.in. That's it. Now, using this object reference of the scanner class, we have to call this method. That is, uh, there are several next kind of methods, okay? For example, if you want to receive an integer input from the user, then we have to use next int method from the scanner class, okay? Or if you want to receive some double decimal number from the decimal number as an input from the user, we have to use next double. Similarly, if you want to receive, okay, uh, a string value, okay, a string input from the user, then you have to use next line. Like that, there are several next kind of methods here. You see next, 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 okay? So next string pattern is also there, okay? So like this, many methods are there. Normal next method also you can use for string. Then byte, okay, boolean, different type of data. For different types of data, we have different type of scanner methods. For now, let's go and use this next line method, okay, which will receive the input. Which type of input from the user? String type of input from the user, okay? And whatever the input this next line method will receive, as an input while the program got executed during the execution of the program from the user, right, as an input, that will store into this string variable. String, let's say location or something, will ask the user to, you know, enter the location. Here, I will simply write down system.out.println, enter your location, enter your location, okay? Like this, that location will be in string format, will be received by next line command and will be stored into the location variable in this case. I'm going to print that location here and I need to close this scanner object, scanner.close once the task is done. Now run the script and observe that in the output as a print statement uh, will guide the user to enter the location by looking at this guided guided message here in the output. Okay, during the program, the program is still running guys. While the program is still executing, we are, uh, the user is being asked to enter the location. I'll simply write down the location as Hyderabad and press enter, okay? And the moment I press enter here, that Hyderabad will go and store into this location and will be printed here, okay? I'll simply press enter. You see, the output Hyderabad got printed. And here you can modify the uh, this output statement, okay? Your location is, okay? Your location is. Now run the code. Again, it will ask us to enter the location. For example, this time if I say Delhi, your location is daily will be printed in the output. So hope guys, you got the answer for this question. So what is the predefined class in Java using which we can receive the input from the user during the program execution? The predefined class is none other than the scanner. Okay, this is the answer for this question. Along with a practical demonstration, I've answered this question for you. I'll provide this code for you. Let's copy this code and provide the code in this, uh, okay. So fine code, this is a code. Fine. So hope guys, you got the answer for this question. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye-bye.